that's your phone. I can't stand it. This is Hoshino. Sherman. You okay? Yeah, I guess. You don't sound okay. You eating well? Uh, no. Then start. A poor diet won't help the grief. Meet me at Heian Tower. What for? That's the last place I saw Arakawa-san. I'll treat you to what he ate as his final meal. Uh, thanks, but right now I... Just be there. Fine. I'll be waiting. Chairman Hoshino wants to meet? Yeah, at Heion Tower. Are you going? Yeah. Maybe he'll tell me about Arakawa-san's last moments. Oh, I'm surprised I haven't gotten that already. It's pretty obvious. Hang on a second. So how does the game end? Me killing Masato? Or me putting him in prison for 20 years? I want you to know, last night, Arakawa seemed at peace. Like an actor stepping off stage to thunderous applause. I think that's because he achieved his goals. He dissolved the Omi, and he got to see you again. He certainly looked like he was enjoying his Peking duck. I commented on it, actually. Can you believe this? He said he'd never had it before. What? He said he almost got to try it 50 years ago, but then his father was killed. Oh, it's an allegory for it happiness. It's been just I out of reach twice. He said I'd walk him to his hotel, but he refused the offer. Said he wanted time alone to just take in the night air. I didn't push it. I just bid him a good evening and left. But if I had pushed it, he'd probably be alive right now. I failed him. 
No, it's not your fault. Let me ask you something. Do you think it was only loyalists? Yes. No doubt in my mind. It was revenge for his role in dissolving the Omi. Men who saw fit to end someone's life over such a thing. How could Yakuza do that? Kill a captain like him? Kasuga. The Omi loyalists in Kanto are already attempting to form a new faction. They complain the loudest about the dissolution. I imagine one of them is the likely culprit. Forming a new faction? After killing Arakawa's son? Yes. Care to hazard a guess as to who is directing them? Because I think it's the one man who could actually bring them to heel. Ryo Aoki. No. A young master? Ordering the death of his own father? He wouldn't be the first to commit patricide for power. The one silver lining is, with Arakawa gone, there's very few men Aoki can give direct orders to. Asuga, you should take revenge for Arakawa. I can lend you men from the Seiryu clan. Am I finally getting a gun? I don't swear to God, don't turn it down. Oh my God. You won't seek vengeance? No. Arakawa-san wouldn't want me to kill the young master. I'm sure of that. Then... What will you do? Before he died, Arakawa talked about how sad it was the Yakuza were getting used. Used like pawns by people in power. That's why he disbanded the Omi. I think he wanted the Yakuza to go back to their roots. Like how they ought to use their power to help the weak and vulnerable. Not just take shit by force. That's how it was. That's how it could be again. Arakawa-san had a dream, and I can continue it. If all I do is kill one guy, especially if it's his son, all of Arakawa's sacrifices will be for nothing. If that's the only thing I do to honor him, I won't be able to face him in the afterlife. <sighs> what I really want to do is open the young master's eyes. Give him a wake-up call. Smack him upside the head if I have to. That's the best thing I could do. Hey, the guy's never been good. Arakawa was truly blessed to have you. Do what you think is right. I'm sorry if my idea of payback offended you in any way. I assure you it did not, Chairman. How do you plan on getting an audience with Aoki? You can't just walk into the Tokyo government office and ask to see the governor. <laughs> It's all good. I think I've got something figured out. You could pull a plan out of your ass just like that, huh? <laughs> Still, going anywhere near Aoki will mean tight security. Take some of my men. At the very least, they'll bring your body back. I appreciate the offer, really. But I'll be fine by myself. I've already got the best crew I could ask for. Let me make a hundred small fry. Oh, jeez. You waited for me? How'd it go? Fine. Sorry to run off and get treated to a fancy meal without you guys. Well, looks like it put some pep back in you. Yeah, I figure if I keep moping around, Arakawa-san's gonna down and kick my ass. But anyway, how about we go visit Kume? Visit Kume? Why? To make him arrange a meeting. I want to meet with Aoki, and Kume's got the hookup. 
seeing as he's Ogasawara's replacement. Sure, but why do you... I'm going to get him to... He's probably just going to set up an ambush, but I guess as a cat on me in. Could do that. Uh, sounds like a long shot. What makes you think Kume will cooperate with you? Oh, did I leave out the part where we rough him up? I mean, the guy deserves it. Hell yeah, he does. I'm in. Get out the bloodhounds and let's start the search. No search required. Today is announcement day. What's that? The deadline for every candidate to submit their paperwork. The political brawl has begun. Man, do you know everything? The fate of the Great Wall hangs on this election. Why wouldn't I be following it closely? Do you know where Kume would be on announcement day? Well, each candidate will give their first speech in their district, usually on a huge stage. Kume's district, Kanagawa second, has a massive stage by the gate on Isazaki Road. Let's head over to Isazaki Road then. Right by the little girl collected money. I'll speak to old girl first. More important. Please just give her the money, you guy. You've got so much. Sure thing. Not sure what that was talking about. Hold on.
Oh, there's another thing back. Yeah, it did seem over than walk. Oh, I'll leave those till after the story. Well, the crime lords cackle with glee. Virtuous law-abiding citizens are cowering in fear. What's become of our once great nation? When did morality become the butt of the joke? I alone can deliver this country back into the hands of her upstanding citizenry. I am Sota Kume, and a vote for me is a vote for change. Damn. After all we've been through, I'm actually starting to agree with the guy. Come on, what he's saying is a load of crap. No matter how drunk everyone is on bleach Japan jungle juice, that kind of drunk can mess you up as bad as my kind. Tragic way, Kume is just another name on Aoki's long list of victims. Hmm. Our enemies don't deserve our sympathy. Good point. Let's get him. Oh, we'll wait till the crowd isn't there. Hey, mind letting us through? Excuse us. I think you might recognize us. Hey, you can't just barge in here. Oh, sorry, sir. Could you just let us. Don't I know you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You were a bodyguard in the parking lot. He's not the only guy we've seen before. There's a bunch of Omi here. Well, look at that. You saved me the trouble of tracking you down. Time to pay for that shit you pulled in the parking lot! Careful scale modeled after that should raise the four great beasts. Just have damage just in one. Can't be wasted on anyone else, but probably wouldn't finish a main guy, so. I'm not back That shit was before most of the now. That's cool. Two damage and it interrupts me. That's tough. Are you done with all the fun and games yet? Ore, ore. Try Come this on, guys. Interfere, did you? Well, not today. I doubt this was the only speech Kume's giving today. Where's he going right now? His campaign stops and stuff are listed on his website. The more people, the better. But I can promise you ain't getting close to Kume. Will he not talk to regular people? No. 
But don't worry, he's gonna win. Governor's orders. All y'all's been blacklisted as threats. You better get ready for the takeover. Boys, then I could count a rolling on over here to Injincho. Whole place will be swarmed. You won't be able to take a shit without us knowing. Fuckers! Aoki's always one step ahead of us. <laughs> I certainly am. I realize there's no precedent for a governor to intervene in national politics. But there's never been a precedent any time we advanced as a society. What about your critics who say you're just too young? That national politics is no place for schoolyard debates? <laughs> Are they implying local politics is some kind of playground? No, I don't think they're saying that. How about we take another look at the survey results? 80% of respondents said they support Governor Aoki assuming the role of party chair. The principal reason for their support was the success of the Kamrocho 3K plan. You never get 80% of that about that Aoki what the hell? I couldn't have achieved the amazing results of a 3K plan without the Tokyo Metropolitan Police. That was how cooperation between law enforcement and local government should look. What about the Yakuza still in Kamurocho after the Tojo clan's collapse? There are rumors that a delegation of Kansai Yakuza have filled the void. By Kansai Yakuza, do you mean the Omi Alliance? Because I recently heard that they are officially dissolved. Yes, that is confirmed. But doesn't that in fact prove something else? Doesn't it prove we can reduce Yakuza activity without a risky policy like the Kamurocho 3K plan? It's not a risky policy. Not compared to the risks of letting Yakuza run free. I'm sure you've also heard that Masumi Arakawa, an officer who spearheaded the dissolution, was murdered. So you see, it may seem like this was a peaceful process, but I think it was anything but. As always, the underworld keeps hidden its dark, unseemly truth. On the other hand, the Kamurocho 3K plan didn't involve any murder at all. My plan was the perfect example of a peaceful process, accomplished with my expertise from Bleach Japan. Speaking of which, the Citizens Liberal Party is endorsing quite a number of Bleach Japan candidates this cycle. As party chair, what are your priorities? I want to rejuvenate the Citizens Liberal Party. The Bleach Japan candidates are young and brimming with energy. By harnessing that energy, I know we can bleach all the gray zones in this entire nation. This bastard's using Arakawa's death to win an election, after all but pulling the trigger himself. It's disgusting. Just when I thought I couldn't hate politicians anymore, he gives me a reason. Guys, remember the mission. Kume's going to give another speech somewhere, so what do we do? Well, judging by how it went down here, we won't be able to lay a finger on him. Sounds like you're in a tight spot. Yeah, this guy moves around, I've never seen him sitting down. Chairman? So, you figured your best path to Aoki was just to scare the shit out of Kume? <laughs> Guilty as charged. But they're always one step ahead of us. Anyway, what are you doing here? I forgot to give you something back at Heian Tower. Eh? Can't think of what that be. What is it? Kazuda, did you already forget the task you entrusted to me? The task I... Oh, the... Oh! Big finding name. a candidate! Candidate. Yes. Remember the whole point of collecting all find? that money to make Kume lose? 
Yeah, did you find someone? Someone who can win? Well, I searched far and wide. But you didn't find anyone. But then, all of a sudden, it hit me. Oh my god, he's yeah. Kasuga. Well, he's gonna choose Kasuga. Kasuga, you should run. Disgusting. What? I only wish I'd thought of it earlier. Wait just a second, back it up. Why the hell should it be me? I don't have a snowball's chance in hell of winning this. True. I doubt you'd even get enough votes to qualify for the return of your registration deposit. So why would you want to flush three million down the drain? Now the money doesn't matter. It does to me. Three million yen is a deal if it gives us a chance to catch Kume. I'm not really following, Chairman. Guess me. In I'm every election, the candidates drive around in their trucks giving speeches. The district's not that big, so they frequently run into each other. When they do, it's customary for them to wish each other luck and shake hands. It's a farce, of course, but it's custom. That's your chance to get close to him. So if I, I could find a cheaper election, way if I spent a few I million. could walk right up to Kume. Compared to Kume, you'd be a nobody, what they call a fringe candidate. Since Kume's victory is assured, he'll be expected to be a good sport. That includes not turning you down for a handshake if you ask for one. He can't just say no? If he did, everyone would say he acted like an arrogant jerk to the underdog. Bad press spreads quickly. And public opinion changes with the wind. You see how perfect it is? This is how you corner Kume. See, you could totally just drive right by us. plan was to make Kume lose. But now the plan is just to use him as a stepping stone, correct? Uh, aren't you guys forgetting something? Ichiban did hard time. For murder. It doesn't matter what's on your record. Once you've served your term, you can run. What do you say, Kasuga? Mm. I wish I could tell you to take your time and think it over, but time is a luxury you don't have. The deadline to announce your candidacy is today. You have to decide right now. Then I'll do it. Seriously? Just because it's legal doesn't mean it's sane, but... Then hurry to the election office and get your paperwork done. It's the government, so naturally they close pretty early. Wait, what time is it? Holy shit, guys, we gotta hurry. Let's run! Where's the election office anyway? In the Nishihama building on Carriage Highway. Thanks! Jump on my dragon cart. Be there in a second. <laughs> that was next door. some tights and while we're on the subject what's the difference between tights and stockings to put it loosely stockings are thin and tights are thick that's it huh that, i guess it's uh, like how boxers are different from boxer briefs huh those are different hmm uh actually they're uh, not really that different are they well i mean boxers are more like shorts aren't they don't bring shorts into this all right that just makes it more confusing I guess we don't know shit if we can't tell the difference between two pairs of underwear. <sighs> hey, don't beat yourselves up. It's just underwear. And what are these that I'm wearing? Wait, I don't want to see that! Okay, those two can definitely look now. I'm in a hurry right now. I've got to register.
dismay. <laughs> Not gonna happen. Should walk around. Be part of the people, you know. Hey, that guy. I don't want him to be a major part of the story for now. Drop by here. Oh, this is one of the locations for a movie I saw last year. Lover of Hana, I think. You guys seen it? Nah. Never really got the chance back when I was on the force. If I had enough money for a movie, I had enough money for cheap sake. And I was still in prison last year, remember? Forget I asked. place Oh that for one more crest Should I open it? Sweet! Elevator. Irashayose! Alright, where are we going? Third floor. Oh, it's part time hero. So does it. Okay. It's not about your office. The table gone just like that. There's nothing to do in here. You need stray when you got this room. Yeah, I must 
Ah, it's only 50. Although the parka was a better parka, it was a regular parka. Right, nice seeing you. Got a wagon to win or something, I don't know. I'm downstairs. Cats, sounds fun. Yeah, I guess I just stumble into them. get those two mixed up. Finally found you. Well, I guess we're all close by, so I just stumbled into one right here. Should I open it? Got it! Oh, that was not worth it. What is this place? This view is incredible! Oops. <laughs> guess my little secret's out, huh? This one of your favorite spots, Xiao? Yeah. I come here by myself whenever I want to get some thinking done. Oh yeah, I feel that. Sure is a pretty sight. The only problem is sometimes balls fly in through the hole. Oops. And you get a home run every once in a while. So you gotta watch out for that too. I don't know if I could think with all that going on. These things respawn, so I don't go to inclined to pick them all up anymore. Feel obligated. Yeah, I didn't get his taxi back.
Those did not respawn. Oh, I'm finding the right cats, and I'm just kidnapping the cats off the street. Now. 